Iron Man has been added to the National Film Registry. It is the first Marvel Cinematic Universe film that's been added to the registry and only the third of comic book movies that's been added following the original 1978 Superman and The Dark Knight. The National Film Registry was established in 1988 and it is a collection of films selected for preservation that is deemed historical, culturally, and aesthetically significant, which is considerably amazing because Iron Man had no script during shooting and everything had to be improvised from an outline that they had. It was practically a $200 million student film. This simply happened because they had a release date before they had a script. Bridges, director John Farmer and Robert Downey Jr. would act out sequences during their rehearsals, with Downey taking on Bridges' role and vice versa to find and essentially improvise their way to a full scene. Meanwhile, the crew was tapping their foot on the stage waiting for the actors to come on, and the result speaks for itself. It was one of the most memorable MCU films owing to the improv prowess of the film's director and star. Subscribe for more irresponsible filmmaking.